and welcome back guys to the plan for this playlist of me playing Fallout New Vegas will be visiting as many side locations as possible doing as many side quests as possible and then we'll do the main questing uh, for this gameplay towards midway through it our goal for main questing is yes man the NCR NCR Bleason for now we're going to go ahead and start grinding levels so we can level up and make things so much easier. We're going to be working on visiting side quest areas and just mostly getting the resources and stuff we need and levels. So, hope everyone enjoys the gameplay. Make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe button, and let's play some Fallout New Vegas. Hi there, sticking around. Say no more. I'm in. Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo, but I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. I know Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere, and Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. A silver tongue would help. Convincing Trudy that we had a good plan to win the fight would also help. I don't think give is in Chet's vocabulary. Even with the town at stake, he'd still make you barter with him. Easy Pete's pretty protective of his dynamite. You'd have to convince him you know a thing or two. Sure can. Take the road southeast out of town till it hits the freeway. Prim is the town with a roller coaster straight south. Can't miss it. NCR patrols do a good job of keeping the highway clear, but I'd keep your gun where you can reach it easily. You never know who you'll run into. Off the road, you'll probably start running into hostile wildlife. My advice would be to stick to the highway when you can. Not in good springs, no. But if you're up for a little scavenging, there's always the schoolhouse. Most of what's in there is junk, but there's this old safe that even Easy Pete wasn't able to crack with dynamite. If you want to take a shot at it, take these. If the lock's too much for you to handle, reading through the magazine might give you the edge you need. You'll need those to pick the lock. Be careful, though. Put too much pressure on them, and they'll snap. Always happy to help someone down on their luck. Welcome back. Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Oh, I'm not much good in a fight with my bum leg. And my supplies are scarce. But I'll give you what I can spare. Sure. 
Sure. Howdy. Too dangerous. So you're planning on taking on Joe?
I was planning on sitting this one out, but for some reason, I can't help but like you. I'm with you. Let me have a word with a few other folk. While everyone does own a gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. The general store probably has what we need in stock. Sure, the outside looks okay, but I think something broke on the inside. Be careful. You looking to buy some supply? Can do. Thanks. Now just hold on. I never voted to take on the Powder Gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking about. You looking to buy some supply? This? You made your point. I can provide people with some leather armor and extra ammo. Sure hope it's worth it. And, uh, I'll be guarding the store while all this is going on. I have to put my business first. You and... So what's going on? Did Sonny agree to help us? Well, I guess that means we're... All right. Time to look alive. The Powder Gangers are here to play. At least six. Joe Cobb included. They look pretty mean. I'll be set up near the...
owe you a huge favor for this. Here, these are technically Crimson Caravan funds, but I know they'll understand once I explain things. I'll stick around for a bit longer, but I'll be gone in a few days. If you ever visit New Vegas, look me up at the Crimson Caravan camp. That was a hell of a... Can do. That was a hell of a can do. Pleasure doing business with you. 
weapon. So when we come back next time, we're going to work our way towards Prim. I'm almost thinking we should go to Power Ganger's prison that's over here somewhere. And we should probably go ahead and, you know, just clear it out. And then sell all the stuff off and get some more bottle caps. Go ahead and buy more supplies. You know, lots of that stuff. So when we come back, we're either going to clear out the prison or we're going to go straight to Prim. Either way, we're going to be doing stuff in this area. Anyways, hope everyone enjoyed this video regarding me playing Final Day Vegas, and I hope everyone's enjoying the series. Make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe, and I'll see you again soon.